will seem that the work here has come to an end. Well, you're back. Oh no, don't start. I've had enough Barrett for one lifetime. I don't need the sequel showing up on my doorstep. More pirates showed up when you were gone. We weren't as lucky this time. Calvert. Troy. Some of the new Dusties. They didn't make it. Well, how could you have? You weren't here. Anyway, I was pinned down behind some crates with Barrett. Bullets and laser fire everywhere. No smile on that damn carefree face of his. Like he knew this was it. I started stealing myself to go out fighting. Then that idiot puts his hand on my shoulder and says, Stay here, Lin. I got you. I do not know Barrett as well as some, but he seems quite confident in his abilities. And not without cause. Next thing I know, two of the pirates are dead, and he's got the third one in a headlock. Drags him out into the open at gunpoint and demands to talk, or else I'm going to demonstrate Newton's third law on this guy's temporal lobe. And that's when they brought out Hella. <sighs> I didn't overhear everything, but after the ten longest seconds of my life, Barrett put his hands up, and both of them ended up getting taken aboard the pirate ship. And that's the last I saw of either of them. Too risky to put that in the message. Too much liability. You know how it is. Our clients need to know when the operations start and stop. We handle the rest. They could have grab jumped anywhere. I tried pinging a transmission to the ship in the comms building before they left, but the pirates must have fried it. You want to try it? Go ahead. But the odds of them being alive, even if you could find them... <sighs> I've lost a lot of people on this run, Dusty. I just want to pack up.
succeed at that before we are discovered. jump calculations before we're out of range. Out of range of what? Out of range of the sensor array on Vectera. Would you keep up? Once we're outside the star system, the bandwidth goes from instant speed to effectively never. What good is sending a transmission down there? You gonna tell Lynn how royally screwed we both are? She doesn't even have a ship. You underestimate how many of my admirers there are in the galaxy, Heller. One of them is bound to show up, looking to reunite with this handsome face. We're doomed. Capital D, doomed. Got it, okay. Whoever finds this, I'm attaching the interstellar coordinates to the metadata on the transmission. Rescue us. Repeat. Rescue us. actually get that computer working again? What? Let me see that. <laughs> Funny. Even knowing he's alive, I still never want to see him again. Hella, on the other hand... Okay. Let me send you the location data embedded in the transmission. Find them, okay? Well, don't start buying me stuffed animals for my birthday or anything. But yes, all right. I don't like seeing my people hurt. Even Barrett and Hella. Just get after them, okay? And hey, if you ever need a little extra help, I've been thinking about a career change lately. Maybe it's time to put Argos behind me. Seems like you've been keeping busy, Dusty. If, uh, you find yourself in need of a capable traveling companion, we should talk. My contract's up with Argos, and I could use a change of scenery. If you give me an outpost to run, I'll have it optimized for rapid material production in no time. 
I can make myself useful in other ways, too. I'm a good hand with explosives, and you'll never hear me complain about carrying a heavy pack. Sure. I don't mind taking orders from a former employee. It can't be worse than working for Barrett. <laughs> After this mess? Certainly. It's just a job. Nothing to get sentimental about. Works for me. I'm not fussy about assignments. I'll go where I'm needed. Right. I'll get to work. Let's catch up later.
Watch for corners or hiding spots. They know this ship better than we do. Have anything of value? worlds to conquer. Always a pleasure. Did you need something?
you were some pirate coming back to kill me. Lucky me, right? Considering the spaceship wreckage, you mean? Yeah, well, you missed the worst of it. Pretty sure we ripped through all the emergency meds that were salvageable. Hey, uh, you know, when I... Ah, we pulled you to the med bench back on Vectera. I honestly thought, shit, I think I just saved someone's life. Oddly proud moment, you know? So, uh, I guess I'm saying, glad I paid it forward. No good deed goes unpunished, as they say. Man, I was so terrified when I got pulled on board that pirate ship. There it was all. Sorry, brother. I'll get us out of this. Trust me. Oh, I'm getting to that. He tells me we need to start pretending to fight each other. <laughs> Trick the pirates into thinking they need to come in before one of us gets killed. I just remember him shouting this kid is a killer how am I supposed to defend myself against these hurly whites he's gonna bite my face off I mean I didn't think it would work but they came in all of a sudden we were wrestling with two of them Barrett reached for one of their guns bingo Blasted the pilot right in the back. <laughs> Through to the flight console. And dropped orbit like a rock off a high rise. <sighs> I blacked out. And when I came to, there he was. Smiling like it was just another day on the job. You miss the fun part, Heller. <laughs> I mean, I go through all the trouble of saving your butt. And you weren't even awake to notice. Then he did the little finger gun thing. Well, no, I don't think so. I 
Caught him holding his ribs a few times. <laughs> Favorite his left leg a bit, you know? Oh, yeah. Probably should have talked about that first. <laughs> Did I mention I'm on a lot of painkillers? So, I was real excited when a ship showed up. <laughs> then, less excited when I realized it was a crimson fleet ship. And then, really, really less excited when Barrett said, it's okay, I got this. He mumbled something to him, and then they were all gone. I was drifting in and out. But, uh, I think I heard the word ransom. I was drifting in and out, but, yeah, I think so. Got a signal from the ship before they grab jumped. Guessing it was Barrett. <laughs> Haven't really been in a good <clears throat> space to have a listen. <laughs> Here you go. Hey, uh, uh, I should come with you, right? I don't think anyone else is coming. <laughs> I think Argos is probably gonna write this whole thing off. <laughs> Plus, I'm 90% sure working for you would be safer. I hope. Yeah. Just, uh, don't ask me to operate any heavy machinery for a while. <sighs> Give me a minute. I think the worst of it is... Yeah, I'll be all right. I'll be all right. Ready to wisecrack with the best of them. Let me know when you want to head out. there might be a spot for me on your ship? I gotta get off this rock. You bet. I've worked on enough remote outposts that I know a thing or two about optimizing them for material production. And if you're in the market for a mining buddy, I'm your guy. Uh, don't worry about me. I'm a tough cookie. The painkillers are starting to work. I'll be just fine after a good nap. Phew, oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. For a second there, I thought you were gonna leave me behind. What's on the agenda today? You got it. Catch you on the flip side, boss. Thanks for letting me tag along. You've given their fleet a lot of trouble, Barrett. Hey, since when is surviving being attacked causing trouble? Isn't that just fighting back? Hey, pilot, could you move your arm a little bit to the left? I can't make out the console. Don't move. He's trying to figure out our destination, probably transmitting this conversation right now while we're still in orbit. Well, yeah, thought I was making that pretty obvious. Okay, okay, put the gun down. I'm done. See? My retinas are pointing away from the console towards this lovely view of space we have out the window. Time up. Once we get back to the base, the fun starts.
listening to my hail. We've been trying to contact you about your ship's extended warranty. Your warranty coverage has expired or is about to expire. Due to the uncertainty of the political situation in the settled systems, we think now is a great time to renew your ship's warranty protection plan, or purchase a new one if you lack coverage. It sounds like you're interested in hearing more. First, I need to inform you about the warranty claims process as laid out by the United Colonies Arbitration Board. UCAB is not a decision maker and cannot change the outcome of a dispute. Before filing, claimants must submit the following 10 forms of information. Complete contact information, make and model of the ship in question, as well as any modifications made to the ship by one of our approved mechanics. Additionally, we require the authorized servicing dealer's contact information, a description of the issues with your component, the resolution you are seeking, monetarily or full replacement, and a signed copy of our information release waiver. Claimants will also need to submit ship logs for the duration the part or parts in question were used, contact information for the three previous owners, and our customer satisfaction guarantee waiver. May I continue? It sounds like you're interested in hearing more. We have several tiers of warranty. Please listen closely as terms and conditions may have changed. Our Power Plant Plus plan provides coverage for an essential list of components related to engines, thrusters, and life support systems and starts at only 50,000 credits. Our Diamond Select plan includes everything in the Power Plant Plus plan with the exception of air conditioning and water recycling, as well as defense systems, limited to non-lethals, as well as bow to stern shield coverage for 100,000 credits. Our Platinum Elite plan includes everything in the Power Plant Plus plan and the Diamond Select plan, excluding thruster bells but including air conditioning, as well as a personal service agent, and starts at only 200,000 credits. Do any of these plans fit your needs or budget? We also have financing plans with excellent interest rates starting at 18.9%. It sounds like you're not interested in hearing more. That's too bad. We'll continue to reach out to you with additional opportunities. Thank you. Thank you. 
low temperatures here. Keep an eye on your vitals. to something.
certainty to the universe at all. Once you really start getting out there, the laws of physics kind of turn into suggestions. riding on it too? Okay, it was more of an extreme of Holy shit. You actually found me. I do not understand. Is Barrett being held hostage or not? Well, this is turning into a regular constellation party, isn't it? I should have brought drinks.
Matsur the Grim here and I actually have a lot in common. Both escape artists. Being captured by Sistep myself plenty of times. See, that's what I'm talking about. Relativity. We're all just creatures of the universe trying to get away from what's after us. You know, it's actually been kind of nice. Matsura the Grim here is a great host. No sense letting people's last moments be unpleasant. See, that's what I like about you, Matsura. Real renaissance man. I have enjoyed our time together, Barrett. But I can't just let you go with nothing to show for it. Is Constellation willing to pay ransom in exchange for this man's freedom? You want me to end all this with nothing to show for it? He does seem to be unusually skilled in that area. He has been more entertaining than most hostages. It has some good friends, it seems. Very well. You're all free to go. It's been a real pleasure, Matt, sir. Really. And good luck out there with all the, you know, hurting people and taking their money. Contraband on board. Halt and prepare to be boarded. All illegal and stolen goods will be confiscated. You're on the wanted list. Halt and prepare to be boarded or we will be forced to open fire. Copy that. Stay on course while we escort you in.
right away, Captain. Sergeant Yumi was looking for you. You will be scared everywhere. Of course, the United Colonies is paying close attention. Heaven forbid something escape their notice. Anything I can help? You're finding everything you need. If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Oh, please, take a look. Thanks for coming in. There's a bit more in the back if you're... Oh, please, take a...
Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. If it belongs on your ship, hope you're finding everything. Oh, please, take a...
Thanks for coming in. do for you. As you enter the city, please keep moving. Of course, the Omega Colonist is paying close attention. Heaven forbid something escape their notice.
I do find that statue pleasing. I wonder if it matches the original vision of the artist, or if they changed the design as they worked on it. I am thankful this way. It's our quick. I do not like being small and close to What did you need? has happened while we have been away. Sorry for the wait, everyone. Got a little held up on Vectera. Barrett, we were worried sick. Well, some of us were. I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. Actually, Walter has been complaining about you more than usual, which is always a sign when he's worried. Don't start, country. Wait, is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library shelf. Now look at them all. You feel it a bit, can't you? Ever since I found the second one, had the visions. Being around them is just comforting. So hey, I I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around, help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe? Marvelous. If you have a moment, I have something I'd like to discuss. 